I'm Marianne Russon, a career technology and science journalist. Welcome to Future Labs 2023. This is where tech innovators and big players in the rail industry create a better future for all of us. Something like that, that should do. A third of all workplace injuries, both in the UK and worldwide, are because of musculoskeletal disorders or manual handling injuries. So we're working with uh, partners like LNER and other rail companies to help protect their staff. Uh, by using our technology, we give their teams insights into where the risks are occurring so that they can proactively prevent them. Future Labs is LNER's Innovation Accelerator programme. It takes small companies and startups um, who pitch their products to solve some of the rail industry challenges and then over 12 weeks they work with us and industry partners to develop their product ready to showcase at Demo Day, which is today. Two million pounds of value. Marianne? Read that out. Okay. Read that to start the recording. Okay. You need to be awake and alert to do your job safely and efficiently. What did you make me do that for? This software can actually measure over a thousand intonations of the voice and the muscles in your neck. So as you become more and more tired, these things will actually pick up the very fine adjustment to your voice. So all you basically do is choose the product you want, select how many of those items, and then hit the start button and off you go. We're basically capturing waste from trains and stations, turning it into a plastic filament locally and then putting that plastic filament in our 3D print vending machines. For example, we've transformed some of LNER's waste into these lanyards that are being used today by the attendees. I thought it was a really fun event. There are a lot of very innovative, compelling solutions and I think this will make a difference not just for consumers but also for solving really big challenges in the rail sector. Yeah.